Revelation chapter number 18 verses 13 and 14 and cinnamon and odor and ointments and frankincense and wine and oil and fine flour and wheat and beets and sheep and horses and chariots and slaves and souls of men and the fruits that thy soul lust after are departed from thee and all things which were dainty and goodly are departed from thee and thou shalt find them no more at all. In verses number 13 and 14, we are continuing with the long list of things that would no longer be available to sell because Babylon the Great has been destroyed. She's been judged. And we can see from verses number 12, 13, and 14, virtually everything that could be sold was sold. You're talking from gold, precious stones, silver. You're talking linen, clothing, fabric, different types of wood, ivory. Then it goes to spices, brass, spices, ointments, frankincense. Then it goes to wine and oil, edible products, fine flour, beets. Then it moves on to animals, sheep, horses, chariots. And it even goes on to individual slaves and souls of men. Then it wraps up the fruits that thy soul lust all type of delectable things could no longer be sold because Babylon the great has fallen this is a long list more than likely of how inclusive the mark of the beast will be no one will be able to buy or sell without this mark. And these verses gives a detailed list. Some of everything. You would have to have the mark of the beast. Do, do, do you see why Antichrist will force people to receive the mark of the beast? A law that will be legislated that will force you to do evil. It will force you that you need this before you can buy or sell. It's only a matter of time before you starve to death. You suffer from hunger. You suffer from the elements. This is how inclusive, this is how Antichrist will demand that everyone worship him and serve him through commerce, through legislation, through laws that dictate you must do this before you can buy. You must do this before you can sell. We can see how things like that are in motion. You have to buy this or you have to buy that. It's a law now. Free society, purchasing from whomever you desire. We can see where that's rapidly is being changed. And we can see in Antichrist Day how that will be completely eliminated. God, in the name of Jesus, give us eyes to see what's going on. And help us to understand the mark of the beast. 
and how it's going to be shrouded in mystery. It's going to be shrouded in commerce. It's going to be shrouded in legislation. Help us to seek you, God. In the name of Jesus, we pray. Thank God. Amen.